a math amazing day, math amazers. I'm Sir Des, your math amazing teacher. Come, let's sing with me. I know that you are scared of mathematics. I heard it a lot of times. Numbers make you feel so problematic. Well, it's true. Oh, did you hear that? What do you think is the animal that made it sound? Hmm, correct, it's a dog. Actually, it's my pet, Chucky. Say hi, Chucky. Today, August 26, is International Dogs Day. And do you know that dogs were the first animals kept as a pet by humans for over 10,000 years ago? Wow! That's amazing, isn't it? Speaking of 10,000, today we're going to learn how to visualize numbers from 1,001 to 10,000. Will you repeat after me? 1,001, 10,000. Good job! Now, get your notebook and pen and make sure to write down important notes during our discussion. Are you ready? Great! Do you remember this? Can you name it? Correct! This is called number disks. We use number disks to represent numbers. We have one, ten, hundred, and thousand. Now, we're going to play a picture puzzle. For you to solve the puzzle, you have to answer each question correctly. Are you ready? Let's start! How many 1,000 do you see? If your answer is 4, well done! Let's proceed to the next question. How many 100 do you see? Three, correct! We're down to the third question. How many 10 do you see? Seven, wow! We are now in the fourth question and I know that you can answer this. How many 1 do you see? It's two! Great! Uh-oh! Two questions to go! Are you ready to answer them? Great, Math Amazers! Let's go! Tell the value in each column to complete the table. Hmm, do you know the answer? Wow, you are correct! We have 4,370 and 2. Finally, we are down to the last question, Math Amazers. Are you excited? That's the spirit! What is the number? Hmm, what do you think is the answer? Let's see if your answer is correct. Congratulations! The answer is 4,372. You are definitely a math amazing kid. And you have math amazingly solved the puzzle, which is a dog. Remember kids, we have to be kind to animals. Most especially those endangered species like turtles, monkeys, birds, and many more. We are grateful that we have them now. But if they're gone, the next generations won't be able to see them. They are going to be extinct. And that is what we don't want to happen, right? I hope you learned a lot today. I'm Sir Tess saying, math isn't hard. 
with surgeon. Until next time, Bethel Mazers, see you! Bye! I know that you were scared of mathematics. I heard it a lot of times.